everything is ready for my best friends to come. Hey, careful! Who's playing a ball in the room? Oh, these are my friends. Sporty Emma, Soft Jenna, and Rocker Betty. I totally forgot that together, they're a walking disaster. Girls, please stop! Get off the couch! Wait, no! Be careful! Why did I decide to live on campus with them? Because of them, I can be expelled. And my dream to work for NASA will never come true. Stop! Enough! You've ruined the room. Uh... You've even torn my favorite Troom Trick logo. We'll fix everything and your room will be one big logo. Are we gonna build a Troom Trick room? Cool! Then let's get to work. We'll clean up all the trash first. Catch it, Emma! How do you like this training? Ouch! Okay, girls, we're moving the beds right next to each other. What's next? We need to paint them. Oh, we ran out of paint. Hmm. We'll buy it in the store. Let's go, girls! Hi! Good afternoon. I see a lot of cool things here. Ooh, a nail. Now I'm a bull. Wow. Oops. Okay, give it back. And the tools too, thanks. How much do we owe you? There are four of you. And you owe me $1,200. What? How much? We heard a thousand two hundred, but we only have three hundred. Then get out of here. Go away. Mm -hmm. oh. I'm so tired of these teens. They watch their troom trick, and then they build these secret rooms, beds, water parks. Phew, it's not easy being a plywood. It's so hard to carry the tools. Let's get to work, girls. We need to put the facade and the beds together. As reliable as an investment in Legos. Oops, looks like I'm part of the bed now. Mm. <laughs> Boom, great. Oh. <laughs> wow. <laughs> now we need to paint the facade. Well, let's start. Not bad. Oh, what color should we choose? Eeny, meeny. I don't remember what's next. The pink color will do. I don't see black. Help me choose a color. What color is on the Dream Drink logo? Write in the comments. Look, of course it's blue. Exactly. Painting with a brush is kind of boring. The hardcore rockers don't follow the rules. They break them. So let's rock and roll in this hole. The bait loves this rhythm. Wow, and some more. Come on, baby, show yourself. Yeah, cool. Oops, sorry, I got carried away. What? Uh, it's time to have some rest. I hit my head too much. It's good there's nothing important in it. I need a pillow. But where can I get it? Oh, I have an idea. Betty! Yeah, what? Throw a couple of twisted pillows on my bat. Okay. What's next? There are no pillows left. Maybe this? Hey, come on! What are you doing, Beth? And a little more! I loved it! No! Oops! Sorry, honey. I didn't mean to. Are you okay? No! Hmm. A ball and a broken flower pot. I'm sure I can fix it. 
I'll just make a new flower pot out of the ball. It's even cooler. The main thing is not to kick it by accident. I'll have to use this skipping rope. I'll buy a new one and this one will be holding my sports plant. Perfect! Oops, what did I step on? A flower pot. Oh, it's training time. If the ball is now a flower pot, then the flower pot is a ball. Okay. Ooh, hey, what are you doing? Oh, my books have fallen, and I don't have anything more important. <sighs> I'm sorry. I won't do it again. Oh, no. No. No, I have to help. I'll just warm up first. Hold on, Sky. I saved your loved ones. That's so cute, thank you. Put them on the bed. The protractor has the perfect shape. What if? Oh, yeah. Now I have a cool shelf. Awesome. Oh, no. Please be quiet. I'm preparing for the exam. Oh, sorry. Didn't mean to bother you. And the mirror is too small. I need to make it larger, like this. <laughs> yeah! Who's the cutest girl in the world? Well, of course, it's me! My wall now seems as empty as Emma's head. Hmm. Oh, I have an idea. I need to get some materials. The grid. Come on! It's not working! Okay, there should definitely be something for my wall. Everything fun's not allowed here. Hey, it's too much! Get out of my shop! He doesn't know I'm a master of disguise. Just tricked a loser. Oh, Betty, what a cool cap. Let me try it on. No, you don't understand. And the raincoat's so stylish. I'm like an English detective. Give it all back now. Come on. Oh, I know this face. I think I've seen you before. A mustache doesn't sue you anyway. Wait a minute, I got it. Go away. He doesn't need to repeat it twice. He needs to repeat it three times. But now I have a grid. That's better. Hi. Ouch. At least it's on my head this time. This is my dumbbell. How did I get here? Ooh, a magnet. Can I have it? Okay. I'll make a lot of small magnets. They'll grow up and have a lot of large ones. But now I need a shelf for my dumbbells. Wow. Great. Thanks, Betty. One magnet's already grown. I'm giving it back. Oh, no, oh, no. What's going on? Help! Anyone! Is this Betty's new song? Ooh, this magnet's too powerful! Oh no! Ew! It was hard to get out of the magnetic field! I need to finish what I started! This room needs a brutal chair! And more pillows to make it soft! Like this! Hey, check it out! Not bad! Hmm, I want some furniture too. This thing makes the lips bigger. Maybe it'll do the same with the perfume? Oh, wow, yeah. Hi, my dear subscribers. Check out my table. Betty, come here. What? <laughs> Me? Never. I'm a rocker. Hmm. <laughs> Hi, my dear subscribers. Cute Betty's here. Check out the chair. I have no axe at all, and Jenny has so many! Guys, please like this video! Mm. No. Wow, what a chandelier! I'm buying it! Where should I hang it? Oh, I have an idea! Sky, be careful! Hey. Oh, I'm sorry! I'm busy, I'm hanging a new chandelier. Where can I get electricity? I have an idea. Mm -hmm. 
<laughs> wow, Emma, you've gained so much weight. You need to work out now. What about an exercise bike? Yes, thank you. Give it to me now. Faster! Faster! Perfect! It looks so cool. Thanks, girls. Let's take a picture. Say trim drag. Uh, excuse me. Urgent delivery for ya. This letter is from Trim Trick. I can't believe it. Coming it faster. They invited me to be an actress. Ah, this is the best day of my life. Yes, yes, thanks. I know I'm the best. Hey. Hello. Sky, we're here. Does she think she's too good for us now? Oh, girls, come here. Hello, girl. <laughs> Look, this is a new video with me. It's not even on YouTube yet. Wow, how does she do it? Hi. Sky has always dreamed of having her own home and family. But in the meantime, she has to live in an orphanage. Life isn't fair. Some people get to live comfortably rich lives, and other people get nothing. Sky's lucky that this time it wasn't a brick that fell on her head. After the previous three, she drew her picture. The rich family came down to get their gold bar. Maybe this little diamond named Sky will come in handy as well. Everything is about to change forever. They live in a beautiful house full of artwork, gold, and jewelry. If Sky doesn't like it, she can always rob them and flee the country. But it's worth giving Emma and Jackson a chance. They even have a butler named Terry. You should only call him when necessary. Sky likes the sound of it. Apparently, she's the only one. To make sure the kid doesn't get lost, her new dad gave her a map of the house. That's huge. I mean, the map, not Sky. Getting to her room is like a whole treasure hunt. Wow. Yeah. Weird. Such a big house and no elevator. Poor Terry has to drag her suitcase. I don't know how that little girl got it all the way here. Apparently, she's a lot stronger than she looks. I'm sure it's full of bricks oh, that wow. keep falling on Sky's head. Let's see. <laughs> I guessed it. But the only thing she'll actually use is her purse. Here's her new room. Sky's thrilled. It's even better than her dreams. This is already the best day of Sky's life. She's used to sleeping on a cardboard box in the alley behind the dumpster. But now she has a rich dad. She'll have to get used to the bed and the fact that Jackson can easily make all her dreams come true. He's amazing. Sky really likes the magic of money. It turns coins into objects. She's seen coins fall before, but nothing like this. Amazing. It's not balloon animals, it's real magic. But Sky still prefers to sleep on the floor. It's good for your back. Parenting is hard. Sky has a family and a home and a room of her own. What more could she want? Well, of course, some spending money. That's the best measure of a parent's love. Jackson isn't stingy at all. Sky wants to know if there's a limit to his generosity. The parents are interested in what their new daughter is doing. Oh, Sky's got a construction project going on. That's so cute. The little girl is trying to build something on her own. But it's really loud, and it's not so cute anymore. Maybe we should have gotten a dog instead of a baby. But can a dog make a makeup table like this? Maybe. Now the room smells like paint. Daddy can do some things too. With a snap of his fingers, the vanity gets filled with the most expensive makeup products. Sky has a lot to learn about money magic. Yeah, air this place out already. Dad decided to give his daughter a tour of the house. Yes, yes, we have our own water park. It's unbelievable. You can't go in there without a cap and a towel. So many troublemakers in the pool. Let's move on. Here's mom's favorite room. 
This is the spa, where she relaxes and charges up with energy. Dad isn't allowed in there. But Sky can go anytime. She loves it. And she just happened to notice a very strange room. They do cloning there. Daddy needs it. Sky is absolutely not allowed to go in there. Can she really be stopped? The cloning isn't working. But then who's this? Clones aren't allowed to leave the room without permission. There's a special secret town nearby just for them. It's Sky's first morning in her new home. Ooh, what's this button? Wow, Sky likes that. I wonder what else these hands can do. Oh, yeah, that's a nice service. You'll be in a good mood in the morning. Now we know the secret to mom's perfect makeup. She noticed that someone cut the tablecloth. Is there a moth in the house? Sky's bandana is kind of suspicious. It's the same color as the tablecloth. This actually came from an auction. And the cost is a number that Sky doesn't even know how to count to. Emma decided to introduce her daughter to the closet so that nothing else would be at risk. It has everything anyone could want. But before you touch the designer stuff, you better go wash your hands. Sky needs to work on her manners. When she lived on the street, no one made her wash her hands. She's scaring her new mom. Ooh, something caught her eye, but the price scared her off. Here we go again, same story. Sky keeps forgetting that she doesn't have to worry about money now. The important thing is that the dress fits. Wow, it looks great on her. Much better than the baggy men's clothes she got from Uncle Bill. But she's not ready to say goodbye to the hat yet. What a beautiful breakfast. Is today some kind of holiday? Every day's a holiday for Sky now. Mom needs to introduce her daughter to cutlery. When Sky ate her soup with her hands, Emma almost threw up. But what's better than eating cake with your hands? You can lick your fingers afterwards. It's like a bonus serving. Mom is shocked by her daughter's behavior. Mom isn't sure if Sky ate with her hands or utensils. Will you comment below and tell her? Thanks in advance. Sky plays games on her phone all day. And mom's upset because she can't get through to her daughter. Well, her iPhone is made out of paper. It doesn't pick up a signal really well. This problem is easy to solve. Millionaire's kids shouldn't walk around with a cardboard iPhone. Emma has a whole bunch of them. You can choose any color you like. It really works. But here's the thing. The real iPhone is very fragile, and it broke already. Which would never have happened to the cardboard one. Sky is cleaning her room. Her hoodie should have been washed a long time ago. That smell used to protect her from insects and rats. Daddy doesn't like seeing his daughter doing laundry. And actually, that's not a washing machine at all. This machine makes incredible smoothies. All you have to do is add ingredients. What? This is something Sky hasn't seen before. Okay. And she's seen a raccoon selling ice cream. The shakes are ready. She's scared to drink it. Daddy likes it. Except for the sock in the glass. What? Now he knows why the drink tastes like feet. Mom is trying to improve her relationship with her daughter. So she prepared a special gift for her. But the trouble is, Skye got an F on her college test. So the gift is canceled until she gets her grade fixed. But punishing kids always backfires. How can she stop herself from peeking? This is a secure lock that can only be opened with likes. Like this video so Sky can get a peek inside. Now she's a regular teenager and needs to do boring homework instead of catching pigeons to eat. Oh, mom's here. She must have brought something fun. Wow, that's a gold pen. This will get her the highest marks of the semester. It's not just any pen, it's magic. It controls the hand of whomever's writing. It's time to do homework. Wow, now she can write without making mistakes. Sky lets go of the pen and continues doing the assignment. It's unbelievable. Great. Sky wants to impress her mom with a good grade. 
But this grade is only thanks to the magic pen. Mommy decided to give her daughter the gift anyway. She promised, didn't she? Sky deserves it. Watching the pen solving her homework took forever. Come on, hurry up and open it and see what's inside. Oh, it's some kind of remote control. Oh, what's it for? Oh, it's the butler, Terry. He's had a chip implanted so he can be controlled. Terry will do whatever Sky wants. What else can he do? Oh, yeah, a relaxing massage. Terry, you're a jeweler. Okay, how do you stop him? The remote stopped working. Terry, stop it. Sky is already getting the hang of it. And she's getting used to eating with utensils. Mom made her favorite skyscraper burger for dinner. Yeah, well, eating with your hands was much more comfortable. She even taught her mom how to do it. Now she's better at it than Sky is. Challenge accepted. Let's go. Oh, looks like the daughter's out of the race. She broke a tooth. There's a coin in the burger. Dad is also trying to bond with his daughter by playing hide and seek with her. He's used to hiding beneath his wealth. But you can't fool Sky like that. She's teasing Jackson and faking that she's giving in. He likes to win. It's important to him. Now let's see if he can find his daughter. She's still internationally wanted for financial fraud. The FBI hasn't found her, so there's no way Dad will. An amusement park. Perfect place to hide. Except it's cold. I should have dressed warmer. We need to hide right away. But here's the problem. The door only opens from the outside. Daddy's getting close. It'd be stupid to just get caught like that. But she doesn't want to freeze either. Staying alive is more important than winning. Jackson found his daughter. He came just in time. She was about to turn into a statue. Mom is introducing her daughter to high art. Since she grew up on the street, she knows more about graffiti. She decided to demonstrate her artistic skills and paint a portrait of her parents. She has an unusual approach, but the result is impressive. Wow, this portrait really shows how graceful and rich this family is. One small detail is missing. Of course, their adopted daughter. You just need to find a good place for this portrait. But you don't have to cover a masterpiece with it. Oh my god. Sky asks her mother to help her with her makeup. She only knows how to do makeup with mud from puddles. Emma is very busy with work. So she tried to do her daughter's makeup as fast as possible. But she missed a bit. Mom's busy, of course. What about dad? Maybe he wants to play tug of war. He doesn't seem to mind. Looks like Sky won, but she's a little upset. So her parents don't have time for her at all. She felt lonely again. Mom has some bad news. She can't find Sky, but she found a letter in her room. Jackson and Emma couldn't handle parenthood. But don't give up. There's still room for improvement. Sky is all alone again. Her parents apologize for everything and want her to return to the luxurious mansion. Of course, she doesn't mind. As long as her parents get rid of their work phones. By the way, Jackson has a surprise for Emma. It's the queen's magic brooch, which she's been wanting forever. Thanks to the magic, her tears finally make some sense. The precious stones cheer her up, and she doesn't want to cry anymore. And they are also a great decoration for her bed. Helen's been spying on her sisters all this time. She wants to decorate her bed, too. But she can't steal Emma's glue gun because of the modern security system. So that's how it works. She always takes everything without asking. It'll teach her a lesson. Nothing special, just a remote with a shutdown button. Helen freaked out and hired a servant. Now she can afford it. He will do all the work for her. The reward is worth it. His eyes sparkled like those blue diamonds. The servant made a craft for her. And her eyes started to sparkle too. 
The sisters decided that he was proposing to Helen. The poor guy got scared by such pressure. He needs to talk to his mother first. The girls started a contest. They need to throw the ball and get as many points as possible. Helen almost got 10. Caroline hit right on the target on the first try. We have a candidate to win. Now it all depends on Emma. She knocked the sister's ball out of the game. How do you think? Who's the winner? Write in the comments. Caroline can't stop looking at her magical diamond. Helen hates her sister's good mood. She better look under her feet. A smile appeared on Helen's evil face. And Caroline made a nice backflip in the air. But her ruby is not like her. It broke into a thousand pieces. It's even better. The world has never seen such an expensive garland. Even Helen is shocked with Caroline's happiness. This is clearly not what she wanted. Helen will be very jealous. Emma is trying hard to learn magic. Now it looks like a children's birthday show. But she quickly develops her skills. If you want her to make a show at your party, write about it in the comments. Look what a cool garland she made from an ordinary scarf. Now her emerald bed shines even more. The sisters are impressed, and your party will shine with diamonds. These expensive earrings turn into a pretty flower. Cool. Maybe the magic can do something with Helen's tool. She tried, but it didn't work out. But Emma turned this rag into a nice emerald tool. It fit perfectly into the emerald bed. Helen is freaking out. We need to calm her down with the magic jewelry. Ew, seems like she's okay now. Helen decided to measure her diamonds in carats and dollars. Hmm. It's kind of dark in the room. She let the cheerful rays of the sun in to play with her stones. Funny, they don't look like her sisters either. That means she loves them. Now she has the perfect chandelier for her bed. The sisters love it too. Caroline liked the Troom Troom trick video. And look what happened. The sisters tried to do the same, and their lives were changed forever. The diamond mood is guaranteed. You should try it too. Like this video and comment down below what changed for you. Has Helen just got a message? The cutest guy in college texted her. Congratulations. A walk with hot dogs. What could be more romantic? A lot of things. But this is the first date in her life. She needs to hide the real Helen as much as possible. But the trouble is, Helen has something stuck in her teeth. The guy tried to gently show it to her. What a shame. It will torture her until the very wedding. Obviously not with this guy. She picked a diamond with a toothpick. The handsome guy liked this trick. Turns out he's the jeweler's son. And Emma has a boyfriend, but no one's ever seen him. The sisters suspect that she sends flowers and gifts to herself. If she had a boyfriend, she wouldn't have time for crafts. But they're actually amazing. Emerald mirror for the Emerald Queen. And the reflection is beautiful. Caroline is even a little jealous of her sister. She needs a mirror too. Oh, it's not nice to steal. Did she think Emma wouldn't notice it? Caroline denies everything. Let a fair fight decide who gets the mirror. But Emma has no time for a fight in her schedule. She could ruin her makeup this way. Even the emerald mirror can't show her perfection properly. Caroline is ironing today. Her favorite ironing mode is a diamond one. It's nice to feel rich, even when you're doing chores. This ironing mode turns the ordinary clothes into precious ones. Oh, sorry, sister, but it really suits you. Caroline is trying to figure out what's missing in her room. Well, of course, a table. And a cocktail for a rich lady. So cute! The dessert is a compliment. Caroline got really hungry. But suddenly she lost her appetite. The disgusting black hair is to blame. The girls got bored. They don't know what to do. 
They've already trolled everyone in TikTok comments. Emma has imagined herself becoming a prom queen 10 times. What's next? Emma came up with a game. The prom cups and her fantasies gave her an idea. The sisters love contests. After all, there's always a winner and a loser in them. The rules are simple. You need to find your stone. Helen guesses first and loses. It's Caroline's turn. You can't hide anything from her. But Emma's moving the cup so fast. Maybe you remembered where which stone is? Give them a clue in the comments. Did you like our new video? Then be sure to like and subscribe. And we'll see you next time.